February 2009 at Shah Field, a vital link in this chain was broken. I came to work that morning. I saw my friend Ramesh feeding the birds. The rest of my colleagues were busy in the workshop. No one was expecting the foreman Tariq to call us to help him at the pit. Hi, good morning, everybody. Come to the Please come. The foreman told us to come and finish the small job, and we would do the permit later. The team set off without a permit to work in a hazardous area. This was a deadly shortcut. It was to be their last journey. Hydrogen sulfide, commonly known as H2S or rotten egg gas, is invisible, heavier than air, and deadly, even at low concentrations. Ramesh descends into a toxic death trap. Ramesh was told to go down into the pit and fix the rope that had slipped off the valve. Then I saw him climb up the ladder to the second and third step, and then he fell down. The foreman called out to me, stop the pump. I didn't know what was going on. I could see Tarek trying to lift Ramesh up, and within less than a minute, Tariq had collapsed to the ground. Panic takes over. Kabir rushes down into the pit. Mustafa leaps down the other side, but the men have less than a minute of exposure to H2S before they fall unconscious. It was a big shock for me. Early morning, as we leave, we need to identify the hazards. And H2S is one of the big monitors that we need on a daily basis to eliminate. If we cannot eliminate it, we need to control. And above all, if we cannot, we need to protect ourselves and protect our employees. The lesson has been learned from this tragic incident, and we have engaged the whole organization to make sure that we do not face this kind of tragedies again.